Hello, my name is Omar Rampasad. It is 4.46 p.m. September 18th, 2019. So I'm going to show you what it looks like. Your heart tag. So the reading went all the way up to almost 2,000 a few minutes ago, so they, the power went down. And the upper arm. is tagged and the power had definitely gone down. So I'll have to catch that the next time. So the chest is tagged, power went down, the back is still tagged, power definitely went down. Okay so I'm gonna check my temperature. So the temperature must really be normal. 36.5 and it is. So the power is low, although I'm still being tracked. So the other side is 37.3. So that reflects the high power before I turned on the camera. So the temperature is higher on the right side. Oh, and the left side is going up. So I'm still being pulsed, although the power is low. So the, um, the strength of the power can, of course, increase in milliseconds. So temperature is still high. So let's see what the, temp what the power is like, is like. So my hand So the chest is going up to over 100. So the power has turned up a little bit. So, yeah. 171 there. So this is around my chest. My heart, excuse me. So the power has gone up just a bit. So the temperature. Thirty six six. Thirty seven one. So that's still high. Thirty six four is normal. So it's still high, reflecting the fact that I'm still being pulsed at a lower power. Um Yeah, so my hand is, there you go, 1219, and I'm looking at this number here. So it goes all the way down to zero, and then it goes back up to over 2,000. Yeah, 2122. So my hand is burning right now. So an infrared camera will show the hand heating up and cooling down. And I'll show you that in a few days.
the hand is always tagged. Sometimes at a very low level and sometimes at an extremely high level and everything in between. See that high number there? This number right here. And the other hand. Ear. And the neck is at 58. The other ear. Thirty two. So my face. is being pulsed under 100 right now. So my face is always swollen. That's because it's being tagged, which is why I get burn marks that takes a while to go away. And uh, sometimes they bur these burn marks take a certain pattern. So what happens is I read, uh, did some research on this, is um, when you're in, in a stationary position, it doesn't have to be in bed, although sometimes I suspect it's done while you're sleeping. Um, you can have a laser just um, just uh, spray your face. And when it's done, it will come out as pimples, the spots. And But these pimples are not regular pimples. They are actually radiation burns that goes underneath the skin to different layers of uh, the skin. And it constantly um, erupts until it, it heals, and that could take months. So um, depending on how, how powerful these lasers are and how deeply it penetrates. And of course, it leaves marks. So the, the, the spraying, so-called spraying, quote unquote, is done in a certain pattern. So if you notice, there are lines on my face. It's done in a certain pattern. So. Um, let me take the pressure, my blood pressure. And I'm getting some stinging sensations on the hips. My arm is also tagged. So the hips one twenty. Those are stings. So that's um, that's the reading, the electrical field reading. That happens when you get stings, that itches. So you have an itch, and uh, when you put a detector near the itch, suddenly it's um, suddenly it's uh, it's uh, it jumps. To 200. The, my head is being pulsed, but at a low level. So I get this um, sudden um, pulses of pain right on the temple and sometimes directly into my eyes. So the blood pressure reading, 122 over 75, which is normal, heart rate of 79. So I'm gonna take it one more time.
So if you look at this, uh, um, well, it's upside down, but I can't move my left hand because it's in the detector. But um, it's in the monitor cuffs. So um, I'm just going to put this down and touch the monitor or close to. And look at the electrical reading go up. So if I were to put the monitor near a live wire, see that wire there? It's leading into the monitor, the heart rate monitor. See the reading at the top left? It's cycling to over a thousand. 864970. Now, if you compare that number, which is a reading close to a live line, because that line is plugged in to the monitor into an outlet, that reading is lower than the reading you just saw pulsed through um, uh, uh, spots on my body in uh, spots where the reading went over 2000 which so it's even higher than these numbers significantly higher because right now it's this monitor is detecting the electrical currents in a live line so the reading of my body is uh, almost twice as high interesting very, very, very interesting. So that's that's how high the power is turned up. So take it off the top of my desk, of my table, and put my hand next to it. And you'll see it pulse through. So I'm looking at this number right here. There you go. 2122. Take my hand away. Put my hand back. 600, 800, 1200 something. Take my hand away. Uh, I'm sorry I'm holding this detector upside down. That's only because and there was a 2000 plus pulse there. That's only because the sensors are on the side. So uh, there are several pulses over 2000. So right now my hand is tagged at a high power it's not always this high, which explains the burning. My hands are actually burning right now. So I'm going to show you the blood pressure reading. It's 110 over 74. The one before that was one hundred and twenty two over seventy five so the blood pressure dropped up and down up and down up and down so I'm gonna take it one more time So it went back up, back up, excuse me, 115 over 79. 
So that's pretty normal. Um, but you see the fluctuation. So it was 115 over 79. That was the last reading. Before that, it was 110 over 74. And before that, it was 122 over 75. And I'm sitting, obviously, no activity involved. I've been sitting for the last hour. And yet, you have fluctuations in the blood pressure. And there are a huge, like bigger fluctuations in this when the power is turned up continuously. But the power is not turned up extremely high right now. So these fluctuations are not very high. So, um, I mean, the, the, uh, the range of fluctuations is not very high. So I'm just going to close it off there.